Today I will be demonstrating how to make a potassium chloride elixir that is typically used to treat hypokalemia in patients. So to prepare 60 ml of the potassium chloride elixir, you first calibrate a 60 ml amber vial with 60 ml of water. And then you mark it up to the 60 ml mark for a reference. Just like that. And you can get rid of the water. To make the preparation, you first would weigh out the about 9 grams of potassium chloride and add it to 30 ml of boiling water. After adding the potassium chloride to the water, you must mix it until it becomes a clear solution. So continue to stir on the hot plate to make sure that all the particles have completely dissolved. Once all the potassium chloride has dissolved, you would then add your sweetener, which is about 10 ml of your simple syrup from your graduated cylinder. So add 10 ml. Okay. And continue to mix until the solution is clear again. And you may also do this on the hot plate to ensure that it does dissolve well. And so the solution does, did clear up again. So now we will be adding a, our third component, which is our USP alcohol, which is a co-solvent. You will be adding 10 ml from the graduated cylinder. And then again, mix until the solution has become clear. Okay. So as you can see, the solution is getting there. So we need to continue to mix. And now, just to add some life to this elixir, we are going to add some watermelon drops of flavor. So five drops. Mix it to ensure that it's uniform. So now that we've made our potassium chloride elixir, we will be adding the 50 ml of the elixir into the calibrated amber vial. And in order to complete the 60 ml, we'll be adding our 10 ml of excess simple syrup into the vial. So now we have made our potassium chloride elixir 60 ml in this amber vial and it's ready to be dispensed to our patient. And we do label it. Label potassium chloride elixir. Please note that when you do distribute the potassium elixir to your patient that it lasts only two weeks and should not be used um, after those two, uh, two weeks of expiration. Um, so dispose of it in a timely manner.